morning and welcome to the 22nd of January. It is Wednesday. I am waiting for Georgie to arrive. Still playing about with the uh, Tropical Twist. Barry M did this on the inner eye, this red on the outer eye, brown in the crease and yellow under the brow. So that's the main colours and probably just swiped a bit of that in the middle as well just to blend everything together. So that's what I have on my eyes. This is what I have on my nails and this is in the colour, what's it called? Crawford's Wine. Hmm, very appropriate. Today's lip liner is a MAC in Anticipation and just the same Estee Lauder lip gloss which is this one here because I find it a really comfortable one in 08 Plum Divine Shimmer. So all that aside, update on my skin it's drying up so it's definitely one of those products so I think tonight I'm going to try the retinol from ordinary again that's what I'm going to do I'm going to use a lot less than I have been using I'm one of those people that thinks more is best when actually more less is best less is more whatever so I'm going to try the ordinary and see if I have a breakout with it and I'm kind of scared because it was really quite a bad breakout and you can see it's now it's really dried up but I will I'm going to put just a, a little bit this evening but in saying that I posted it on my Instagram and I had a lot of people message me saying that they've had problems with both the ordinary products and the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream. So like I said, it could have been such a bad breakout because I used both and I, my skin doesn't agree with both. But I'm going to try the ordinary and see what happens with that. I'll give that a couple of days. Any breakouts, that's it. Then I'll let my skin clear and then try the um, Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream. Not so magic for me. Having a quick coffee. Let's do an outfit. I just look there. Let's do a quick outfit. I'm really enjoying this shopping for my wardrobe. In fact, what I'm doing is I'm going through everything. Well, I'm trying to go through my clothes. Anything I put on and I don't like goes into a charity bag straight away. That's how I'm doing the clear out. Rather than taking everything out, unless it's something I know I don't like or doesn't fit without trying it on then I just take those things or I know I'm not going to wear I know I don't like anymore then that goes straight into charity bag but right now things like these jeans that I've had sitting in my wardrobe for a while which I'll show you in a minute these are a pair of kind of mum like jeans from Next which is not the kind of style I normally go for but I bought it for a reason I've, I obviously bought it because I like it and actually I put it on and I like it yes they don't look, make you look as slim as you know the tighter jeans but really comfortable and yeah let me show you these are the jeans again a few years old from next kind of mid rise I would say but very loose fitting as you can see and yeah I think these are a great colour for both winter and summer the kind of really you know quite loose fitting on the top I just have a polo neck which has some nice details here and I've got that same detail on the back I can't actually remember where the polo neck is from Um, it's just a plain black polo neck so yeah and my Hermes belt just to bring it all together so yeah this is an outfit I'm gonna keep I put it on this morning and I liked it so it will go back in the wardrobe if I didn't like it, it would have gone in the charity bag so that's what I'm doing I'm trying to wear different outfits every day and decide and just get rid of things that don't fit and I don't like because I do have a lot of things in there that don't fit anymore unfortunately you're having fun whoa <laughs> Hands. Wow! Fast, go! Go! Wow! <laughs> 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 
So Judge is Rita. doing the trampoline oh, whilst like following it. a yeah. YouTube video. Yeah, on the floor. I'm sure you've done it before. <laughs> but when you do it on the trampoline, Whoa. it just adds Woo. an extra. Woo. Wow! Woo! Woo. Find that center. Yeah, it's it's more more. <laughs> Four. Yeah, you judge it. Yeah. 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 So we're in home base at the moment, looking for a, a bulb for our oven. Mm -hmm. You want that for your room? That one? Yeah. Yeah. Do you not have a little table and chairs? Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure you do. I think it's a nice little storage for you. This is a nice wee size for my own suite, which I'm needing to change. A nice little cupboard at the bottom. Like it because it's small. Georgie's choosing a chair for her room, so do you like that one? What about this yellow one? What's that? Okay, now in Aldi's, so these tulips look beautiful. Need some for my window. Daffodils. Carnations, these last forever. Here's mm. Rico's favourite place. Oh, oh look, there's some Riesling in here. Look at this here as well. What's that? That's uh, German Riesling. Dry. That's different to what yeah, we... Yeah, what we, got, we had the other day. Yeah, that was... That one was from, uh, so. George is enjoying biscuits. What have we got? Where's this from? What country is the origin of it? That looks like the one we had. This is Australian. Australian. So we just get that. Is it dry? Where did they get this from? There, yeah, it's over there. It's a good price. Dry it? and steely. Get one from one of them as well. Then that's just got two. All right. Sparkling wines here, six ninety nine. Seven. No, you've had enough. You've had enough. We'll have one more when we go home, okay? I love all these random things they have in Aldi's. Here, are all the. Uh, Moisturizers. Here we go. We've got some kettlebells here. Six kilograms, slightly too light. Some eight here. Let me try these out. So what price are these? It's a good price. We are home from Aldi's, so I feel an Aldi haul coming along. Judge is uh, enjoying her uh, biscuits. Papa's going to enjoy a biscuit too. So we got Aldi's chocolate digestives, which I'm going to have one with my coffee as well once I've done the haul. And I also picked up the kettlebell which these are great for exercising um, in the eight kilogram. So again, adding, I think that's the last thing I need as part of my exercise regime. So we have some olive oil, which we use these for lighting my mom's candle, her candili. We picked up some wine. So we've got some We've got some Riesling from Aldi's, more olive oil, this is Galamada Extra Virgin Olive Oil. So we use this, plus we've still got some of our own olive oil. Georgie's Juice, this is the Apple and Black Currant Oracle, we need to remember this is double strength, so we need less of this. So this is what we keep in the house for Georgie. This is our carpet stain remover. Juice that Georgie was drinking in Aldi's. There we go. Here's your juice. Want some more? Will I put it in a cup? Will I put it in a cup for you? Or do you want a straw? What is this? Mediterranean flavour tonic water. 
Did you just get this to try, Rico? I've had it before. What well, have you? Just to it brought it with a. Uh... It's not um, low calorie though. Okay. Okay. It's for thin people like me. <laughs> trying to say I'm fat. I never said that. Might remind you of what the woman said in Aldi. You can certainly remind me. It's not the first time, honey. That's okay. But I can take it on the chin. Okay. And also I can take full fat tonic water. <laughs> yeah, okay. Olive oil. Milk. There we go. We have... Well, it's semi-skimmed milk. Don't really, Rick and I don't really take milk in our coffees or anything, but anyway, milk. I've been taking it in cereal every morning. All oh, right, okay. I'm in the brand flakes. So we have the, this is the new collection that Aldi do now, so it doesn't really resemble the Jo Malone ones anymore. So this is the number 24 Rose Noir Diffuser. Got the candle in that as well. It smells lovely. Here we go. Another Riesling. What have you got? Oh, you've got a big straw. One's wow. German, one's Australian. Oh, are they different? One's, one's from Germany, one's Australian. Okay, I thought they were the same. Okay, this is the Australian one. Yep. And the other one was the German, German one. Okay, the one we reviewed was German, wasn't it? Yep. And another tonic water. Oh, no, this is elderflower. Are they, is that sparkling or is that no, a cordial? No. Sparkling. no sparkling. sparkling. Okay. So you would use that without the tonic then? So that's just a flavoured tonic, yeah. okay. Okay, in this bag here we have some tomatoes. We have an iceberg lettuce. We have decided to try these vanilla pods. They're about half the price of the um, Nespresso ones. I have had them before, but... I'd normally need to double them up, so I don't know if, you know, they are good value for money because I have to normally use two pods, but I just got one packet to try them. Why not? Mushrooms for our sausage casserole that we're cooking today. Okay, some sausages for the sausage casserole. Yes, I got you more. You want to help me? Give that to Bapu to put away, okay? So that's four, four pork sausages. And uh, we have another packet of pork sausage. Do you like sausages? Well, you can have some with us when Bapu makes them. Okay, you give them to Bapu. And these are great for a quick meal. The butter beans, what selection of butter beans and, and cannellini beans. So we just fry up some onion, garlic, and then just add these and they're delicious for a midweek meal. So here we have a sweet potato, which we're going to cook and mash to go with our sausage casserole. And that, my friends, is the haul. Good girl, you help me, Papu? That's a good girl. I better move my boots from the middle of the floor. And these are the flowers that I went for. For two reasons, they last for ages, and the stalks on them were really long, because the vase I want to use is quite a big vase. So I'm just going to put them in my uh, sitting room. I should have actually got some of those tulips for here. Never mind, next time. Right, you two, come on. Flowers are at the window. There we go, looking lovely. Come on, Lily, out. Lily, and you go. Georgie, out. Come on, let's go. Out, 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 out. Making footprints on my carpet. Look, oh dear. <laughs> You're making footprints on my carpet? Yeah. Yeah? Lily and me. Lily and you. Okay, let's open this up. Here it is. The kettlebell. Lovely. And it's really good at getting the old heart going just by swinging it. So, yeah. And it also comes with a leaflet showing you different exercises. So I think that's me complete. Now I've got my trampoline, which is really, I'm really loving it. And it's fun. It's, it's fun jumping up and down on it. And it got, you've got great YouTube videos to follow, like 
different levels, just all different types. So I'm really been enjoying the trampoline. I've got my weights when I really want to, because I want to keep up my strength. I do, I still do my press ups, and um, that's it. Really, go out for my walks. So I'm getting my exercise done, I'm closing my rings. You know, the difference being, okay, when I used to go to the gym, I used to close my rings during the class. I used to do a couple of classes, the rings would be closed. But when I got home, I was exhausted. Now I've got time and the energy to do things that I really enjoy. So I don't come home absolutely exhausted and think, oh God, I've got the housework to do. Do my housework, do a bit of jumping on the trampoline in between the day. Whilst I'm watching the program, and these are all things I enjoy. I've always enjoyed kettlebells. I didn't ever, yes, I'd have more. I didn't ever in, uh, do any classes with. You want a cuddle? Okay, come on now to have a cuddle. <laughs> Give me a wee kiss. A wee kiss. Mm. Hey, Gabby. You playing with the cars? Okay. I'm going to play with the cars. Yeah, I was just saying to our friends here that um, I didn't really do any exercises at the gym with the kettlebells, but I used to have a kettlebell years ago and I used to do that. Will I show you? Uh huh. You just want to be in the camera, don't you? Yeah. Do you want to see Aya's kettlebell? It's very heavy. Okay. I'm doing the cooking this evening because Rico was out and I'm hungry, so I've started just frying up my sausages. I've chopped up my onions. And I've washed my mushrooms. Rico can do this for the sweet potato. Mm -hmm.